Good morning, brothers and sisters, lovers, haters, boys, girls in vibrations. Now, after listening to the controversy, after studying both sides of the argument, and after watching the freeze frames of the fight last night, I've deemed Daniel Dubois' low blow a legal blow. I'll put a picture of it in the thumbnail. It was on the waistline. I thought his shorts were slightly high anyway. And the glove looked to me like it landed on the waistline. Now, the the legal area for a blow is from the belly button upwards. Now, even if that glove lands three quarters of the way under the belly button as long as there's a fraction of the glove on the waistline you know it's a legal blow in my opinion now i can liken that to a football going over the line the entire football has to go over the line for it to be declared a goal well i deem an illegal punch the same the entire glove has to go below the waistline for it to be classed as an illegal blow. So my conclusion is Daniel Dubois has been robbed of world gold. I never noticed it as much last night because I was doing a live and commentating and it never had my sole focus. But after looking at it this morning, I came to the conclusion that it was a legal punch and you know it was a fight ending punch, wasn't it? Because he was down for three, four plus minutes. Now, I do think Daniel Dubois was outclassed when it comes to skill sets. Even though he definitely belonged in there with him, Dubois belonged in there with Usyk. You know, he was he was busy, he was making efforts, he was trying, and it wasn't a, a landslide of a fight by any stretch. Now, <clears throat> the referee never took any points for the low blow. And what else I noticed was when... Usyk was complaining about the low blows. Then the referee was warning Dubois. Now, it's not up to a fighter to tell a referee whether a shot is legal or not. In my opinion, if the referee doesn't see that the punch is a low blow or doesn't see an illegal punch of any type, then you don't take the fighter's word for it. You know, it looked like he wasn't going to warn him a few times until Usyk complained. Well, that's not what a referee's job isn't, to listen to a fighter. If he doesn't see that the punch has landed illegally, then, you know, technically it didn't land. It's not an illegal punch if the referee didn't see it. You know, these referees don't just take a fighter's word for it. They have to see the punch themselves. So, my conclusion is Daniel Dubois has been robbed of three, four world titles, which is a shame. Um, and that's my conclusion. It was a legal punch and Dubois was robbed. Have a nice Sunday, brothers and sisters. Bye-bye for now.